Oi, 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 welcome to Scuddy. It's your boy Ciso, and I'm back with another video. So, yeah, man, let's get this consistency started. Just posted a video recently. Um, sorry for not telling you guys, but yeah, that video was shot a while back. I said it in the description, but I didn't say it in the video. So, yeah, man, now you know. Um, so today I'm gonna try and keep it like a lot shorter than the previous video let's hope i can get like you know five minutes besides like intros and whatever and outros yeah but so um yeah let's get straight into it man let's start off with world premiere the trial go or how the last few days go so um saturday i went back uh saturday the head coach wasn't there because they had a game so he was there it was just the assistant coach and that so yeah um uh, we just played uh small-sided games um so yeah uh, it was good it was good you know chilled uh a regular you know uh, a light session so yeah we just played small sided games uh yeah i enjoyed it then monday came um monday i went and monday morning uh how it started off was we went and then they had a meeting on the game uh that was played the saturday and yeah it was like a long ass meeting we were like there for like two hours just playing rondos um and yeah <sighs> two hours imagine we even got tired and we we're just like chilling we we're like nah man imagine making ourselves tired and the session hasn't even started yet but yeah um then they finally finished the meeting and we played 8v8 uh games obviously warm up then we played 8v8 games and that was good yeah um i was on the winning team my team was on fire on fire i was playing in the midfield with one of their senior midfielders and just yeah we're just yeah we're just yeah you know what that is we're just yeah just oh yeah, man we were just there man and i enjoyed it you know i was on fire uh touches are really good uh all around i played really well you know i was i was i was happy you know i was proud i feel like i impressed um and then yeah uh, end of the session came and uh, the manager asked to speak to three of the trialists and yeah then they had another meeting at the end and he spoke to us basically in the meeting um, he told me whether he wants me to stay or go <laughs> What you guys think he told me, huh? What you guys think he told me, huh? Uh, judgment day. Uh, the manager spoke to me and he said, uh, thanks for coming. Um, it was good having you, but um, you did not make the cut. Oh. That hurt. Just telling you guys that hurt. Yo, can remember the pain that I felt that day you know but um yeah i asked him why and his reason or i asked him can i please have a reason for why you're not taking me or why i did not make the cut because i felt i did really well like i said and his reason was the position that i play midfield um that group of the squad is that group of the squad is the most experienced part of the team um, and for me, having a lack of experience at the high level, um, it would be hard for me to break in and around the team in that position. Um, so, yeah, that is his reasoning. And do I believe that reasoning? Of course I do. But, yeah, man, uh, you know how we do, uh, we move. P. 
picture champ pop Kabo to the bo abu babu labu my sister tayo shoe costina we move picture yeah but now man so yeah you said i did not make it and yeah i didn't really take it that hard because um i knew that i played well and i knew that i showed them or i gave them all that i had you know i knew that um i was up to standard and i was up to the caliber of their players so yeah i left there with my head held high um obviously it was still demotivating because you guys saw in the previous video how excited i was and how much i thought that uh this is it uh but yeah turned out wasn't that uh god has greater plans and you know what man um we'll just see where that takes me so uh, what happened after that and what's supposed to happen or what was supposed to happen um, Let's get it um, Yeah, so um, After that I spoke to my uncle the one that took me to the team to get on trial and He said that um, Okay, because of COVID it, it's, it's really hard for him to get me into teams right now and because of the time that I went it was like the last week of the transfer window it was hard for me to go anywhere else. I would have had to be like messy, you know, and just shine on my first day, um, which is a big ask because I'm not messy. Um, but yeah, then we spoke and the way forward was going to be once uh, COVID restrictions or lockdown restrictions are um, upheld. I don't know if I said it right, but yeah, man. Um, once the... Um, or oh, let's say lifted yeah lifted once they're lifted um he'll take me to a team in the vodacom league uh, which is the abc mutepe league um third division in south africa which was which would have been um really good i was excited for that also because again it's a step higher than what i started off playing in last year so either way to stay close to the goal and i was excited about that you know i was really happy um then uh let's just say i had uh personal issues up here in joburg i don't know if it's personal family issues up in joburg and i had to come back here uh the plan was initially to come back for a month and then go back once everything is like you know settled the site um but uh things kind of took a turn and seems yeah, I'm going to be staying in Joburg. Uh, so, yeah, man. Yeah, I'm staying in Joburg now, and I'm back here. Unfortunately, Cape Town isn't the place for me right now. Um, hopefully, I can go back soon or another time, because I really feel that I will flourish that time. But, uh, yeah, man, um, right now, uh I got a job from my old coach, uh, Bevan Bowers, a uh, former pro. Um, but yeah, I got a job from him. Uh, luckily, you know, um, an old connection of mine uh, sort of uh, helped me or is going to help me, like, you know, set myself up for the future or for the near future. And, you know, that's just a young tip for you guys, man. Don't burn bridges, you know. Um, you never know if you're going to need somebody uh, later in life or if they could help you later in life, you know. Um, so, yeah, don't burn bridges, man. Keep the bridges. Oh, no, man. <laughs> oh, no, what's the word? But, yeah, um, let's, yeah, so he got me a job, so now I got a job, which is important because, um, you know, 20 years old can't be staying at mom's house for free or staying wherever for free, you know, um, yeah man gotta pay my dues gotta pay some sort of bills but yeah so luckily i got a job but the problem with that is now um the times that we train is during normal team training times or in the league that i played for in the league that i played before yeah most teams train during the time that i'm working um good thing is if i do get a club the club has to be abc mutepe and up because the team has to train in the morning so yeah man fingers crossed that i do get a team in a higher league um but right now um a coach of mine uh, that i played for before um 
he called me and asked me to come through and play for his team. Uh, level is not really important right now. Uh, it's not where I would want to be playing, but um, the coaching is top class. So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to the coaching and growing under the coach. Um, but, yeah, like I said, man, hopefully I can move up and get to a higher level. Uh, while keeping this job because I'm coaching and I'm really enjoying coaching the youth, you know, it's, it's, it's vibes, man. So yeah, that's basically my life. You guys have caught up with my life. So yeah. Yeah. So now that you guys are caught up with my life and caught up with what's going on in my life. Um, yeah, man, uh, guys, I hope that I can bring more content for you guys and I hope that I can be or start uh, filming more consistently. Um, yeah, man, even if it's just a, a day in the life of, you know, those vibes. Uh, yeah, day in the life of a coach, day in the life of a player. But yeah, uh, I'll try my best to start uh, producing more content consistently, even if it's just short videos, you know, uh, maybe a young workout here and there. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to put out more content consistently for you guys because um, I need you guys to move up in life. And hopefully I can also help you guys in some sort of way. Um, I know there's a kid out there who's watching and um, hopefully some of the experience that experiences that I go through and that I share, um, he'll need or he'll learn from ahead of time. So... Yeah, uh, it's good talking to you guys. I'm going to see you guys soon, man. I'm going to see you guys soon. But otherwise, guys, please don't forget to like. Please like, guys. Subscribe. It really does not take that long. All you're doing is clicking a button, guys. Clicking a button. So before I go, I'm going to leave you guys to like and subscribe. Ciao. Do that. should be done right now so guys thanks a lot for watching the video if you did get this far i know there's a lot of you guys that didn't get this far and to you guys um thanks for still going into the video man i appreciate you nonetheless you know um much love guys hope you enjoyed uh, i'll see you guys next time this was definitely not five minutes but uh we move Adios, my people. Being weezy, that's the way. Through the ice in this pattern, my data 180. I went up the wrong way. Look at the bells and the twinkling, glistening, shine. You gon' need.